Yo, what's up guys, how you all doing today? My name is Daniel and welcome to another video. Today we're gonna take a look on top 3 upcoming IPOs. Two of them will go IPO in 2021. I'm also gonna give you one bonus and a big warning on the end of the video. So stay tuned, let's go. Before we jump onto the first IPO that we have, let's answer this question first. How could you possibly buy a pre-IPO? Let's imagine Tesla's share right now, which current price is at $668. How it would feel if you've got the opportunity to buy the Tesla's share before it got to the market? Well guys, you got two options. Option number one, you have to become accredited investor. What does it mean? You've gotta have one million dollars in assets. Yeah, that sounds fucking awful, but it is what it is. If there's some investor who is watching this video and who's got at least one million dollars in assets, feel free to contact me. I'm going to give you all the information that you need. Are you sure about that? To buy pre-IPOs. By the way, you can do it also online. There are four websites that I'm going to put down in the description but you also have to confirm there that you've got at least one million dollars in assets so the option number two hedge funds there are funds like Baron Funds, ARK by Kathy Woods or Vanguard who are already invested in private companies which just will go onto the market. So yeah, these are the two options that you can invest in pre-IPO companies. So the IPO number one on our list, Robinhood. Robinhood is an American financial service company known for offering commission-free trades of stocks and exchange-traded funds. The company's revenue revenue comes from three main sources, interest earned on customers, cash balances and selling order information to high frequency traders. In 2020 Robinhood had 13 million users. Well one of the biggest problem for Robinhood is actually the platform is not supported in Europe. You have to be an American so all of you guys from America you're the lucky ones but maybe in future Robinhood will also come on the European field. Robinhood's IPO is actually estimated in May 2021. So yeah, we have to wait one more month. Current market cap is estimated around 20 billion dollars and Robinhood is also estimated to go with this price IPO. The IPO number two on our list, Coinbase. Probably all of you have heard the name Coinbase. It is a digital currency exchange of Bitcoin, Bitcoin Cash, Ethereum, Ethereum Classic and many other cryptocurrencies, probably most of them. It is currently the largest cryptocurrency exchange in the United States by trading volume. It is already valued at 100 billion dollars pre-IPO, which is absolutely crazy, I mean, but it's due to the fact that they are the biggest crypto broker on the world. And I think after they will go IPO, their price will go much higher. The future is in crypto. Most of the people in the world believes in crypto. Most of the people in the world know Coinbase. And I think that they're gonna just shoot this price on the moon. Quick fact, 86% of total profits from Coinbase, so the profits that they are making, are from the transactions. So like when you buy Bitcoin, so most of the money are from these transactions. Their IPO is estimated on April 2021, so again, we are very close. Are you sure about that? And the last but not least IPO on our list is Starlink. It is a satellite internet constellation being constructed by SpaceX providing satellite internet access. SpaceX plans to sell some of the satellites for military, scientific or exploratory purposes. The cost of the decade-long project to design, build and deploy the constellation was estimated by SpaceX to be at least 10 billion dollars. This is the tweet that Elon made in September 2020. We will probably IPO Starlink, but only several years in the future when revenue growth is smooth and predictable. Public market does not like erotic cash flow. I'm a huge fan of a small retail investors. We'll make sure they get top priority. You can hold me to it. Those are words that we needed to hear. This may mean that Elon is going to give us retail investors some opportunity, some chance to buy maybe pre-IPO of Starlink. Who knows? We will see. Like Starlink didn't estimate it the date of IPO yet, so it's all just speculation. But this leads me to a bonus. A bonus how to invest in SpaceX or Starlink. So again, option number one, are you an accredited investor? 
If you are, you won. You can already invest in these private companies without any problem. Option number two, ETF. Scottish Mortgage Investment Trust. It is actually a fund that is available on eToros. We've got it right here. There was some major drop in January. Another ETF that will offer SpaceX with Starlink will be actually the newest ETF by Cathy Woods and ARK Investments called ARKX. ARKX isn't available yet, but they've said it's going to be available on the end of the March. But to be honest, probably we're gonna see it in April or in May. It's going to be a space exploration ETF with all of these space companies. So I personally think I'm gonna consider to buying this ETF because this ETF is going to bring such a big attention of the world because all of these companies will be available to buy. So yeah, I think that's gonna also shoot the fucking price to the moon. And the option number three is actually very interesting. When you buy a share of Google, you do own a piece of SpaceX because Google owns 7.5% of SpaceX. So if you want to participate in SpaceX, buy a piece of Google. And for the end of today's video, guys, I've got for you a big warning. When we look at this graph, of all IPOs year by year from 2000 to 2021, where in 2000 in that com bubble did 397 companies go IPO, in 2020 it was 480, and in 2021 we are 3 months in, actually let's count it as a 4 months in. In 4 months 370 companies did go IPO. And now guys, what does it tell you? Well, when you look at graph of 2020 IPOs, by months and you look at the march or the corona happened look at the fucking march there was only five ipos and why because market fucking dropped and in the following months the ipo was growing 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 as the market was growing up the ipos were growing basically it's due to the fact that there was a huge positivity on the market and any fucking company that people might know just you know you saw some advertisement on google or you saw commercial in tv any of these fucking companies they're going for ipo and why because they see all of the others ipo who steps into the market and they gain in one day fucking 100 200 percent this is mental isn't it so these people are going ipo they sell their own shares they make money and you are fucked. When you look at some old ones, well actually it's the case of most IPOs where the price jumps in one day by 100% and on the second day it drops by 50%. It's kind of fucking crazy. And this graph just shows it. Here was the negativity time around March and April 2020 and then it went slowly up. And now we are on a fucking point of 370 in 4 months. Can you fucking imagine the number at the end of the year? By this tempo we're going to hit fucking 1000 of companies. I think that either there's gonna be some regulation for these companies or, or yeah just market will fucking crash and we are already crashing. So just don't get fooled by every company that gets on the market. <laughs> it's all just a big fucking bubble. Like in 2000s, there was a tech bubble and we can call 2021 as a IPO bubble. Just a fucking hype train, nothing more. Yeah guys, so that's all for today's video. If you would like to join our group on eToro, our group of copiers, our financial group, this is our little fund of currently 71 companies. 19 of you are already there. By the way, thank you very much to each one of you. I did already message you. I just love to be personal with my copiers and actually all of you guys. So if you've got any questions, feel free to ask me. Feel free to join our group. We're growing slowly but surely. And I got for you another thing, a book, Stuck Investing for Dummies. Link is down in the description. You can go and order it from Amazon. This book literally helps you in the beginning of your investing career so if you're interested in link is down in the description yeah guys so i hope you've enjoyed this video if you did please hit that like button join our investing family on youtube so subscribe come and join our group on eToro we're gonna get in touch and we're gonna build something fucking huge out of this guys have a great week love you all peace